Welcome back to part 3 of this The Dark Eye Let's Play and the party may begin now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You've arrived at the place that you're going to anti-burglar. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's our mission. Yes, yes. anti-burglary. Okay, anti because we are not thieves. Definitely yeah. not. No. Yeah. Yeah. We're totally anti innocent. Anti totally thieves. respectable citizens. That's not yes. going to stab anyone at all. Yes, please. During the evening. Except the rose, of Except course. Except the rose. Yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> the first thing that you see when you step inside is a fountain in a big anteroom. And usually you guess at least that the fountain uses water, but tonight it uses wine. Whoa. So there's a, a heady smell <laughs> of wine and alcohol in the air. And there, maybe there are real fish on other days, but right now if you look <laughs> into the into the ruby red depths of the basin, you see small jeweled fish that actually move their tails because Belhanka is also one of the cities where there are very good artisans who work with the small machinery and cogs and no one would notice if one right. <laughs> <laughs> you, you want to steal one of the mechanical fish? Yes, if they're it, jewels. She just accidentally picks up one while scooping out some wine. I'm right? going to get some wine from the fountain. Yes, lots of, lots of people do. <laughs> Maybe, um, basically, the first thing you notice after there's a fountain full of wine is an elderly lady taking two kids who are trying to, to get a glass of wine from the fountain. Here he just drags them away from that and says, that's not for you, that's for the grown-ups. Now behave yourself and it disappears with, with them. I'm going to casually them. stroll by and try oh, yes. to... Is there like, is there, are there other glasses? Or yes, there are. Um, and when, when you step inside, there's also an elder gentleman who asks for your invitation and just nods at you as you show them. But I so smile at him and... Directs uh, you. And uh, yes. in a few minutes, uh, we will open the buffet. It's going to be to the right. There's also going to be the music and the dancing is going to be in this part of the building. And later on there's going to be um, a moment where we show around some of our guests who are interested in the paintings and uh, the building as well. Mm. Thank you. Very that, nice. loves, that sounds lovely. Mm. Now nice. enjoy yourselves. So we will. We definitely will, I say. Yes, and I yes we will. a charming <laughs> smile. Yes. Totally. She's <laughs> trying the same, but... <laughs> Ah, I see, you're one of the guests who have been invited for entertainment. He's yes, he is, isn't he just? <laughs> isn't he doing his character very well? <laughs> Great, I love a bit of theatre. You should just hear the slight sound of grinding teeth. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, I definitely want to get a goblin and try, and try yeah. some of that wine. Yes. Yes, me too, of course. It's not the most expensive one. Of course, you probably you. wouldn't use that in fountain, but it's the whole thing is very flashy and a bit on the nose. You know, we're rich and a Belhanka. <laughs> this room's giving me a headache with the and wine in the air. And you're yes. trying to and scoop, I'm trying to scoop yes. up uh, one, one or two of the, the jeweled fish. You do that. Okay, there's a, there's a lot of people around who are all sing and trying to scoop up a bit of wine and who are doing a bit of a useless conversation around you. So it's going to be a little bit harder. You have to roll one less on each well, of your right. attributes. I, I think I'll do a little distraction uh, okay. by uh, explaining. Because you're getting the most beautiful one. Right, I'm, I'm getting into a, a little argument with you because you were uh, complaining about the wine smells, right? You were... Oh, yeah, you yes. go, go yes. right. Argue. <laughs> right, so... Uh, <sighs> I mean, it's uh, so... Don't you uh, enjoy this lovely uh, fountain here? No. I mean, you, oh, it's whenever silly. you hear Thistle, you only have to complain. Yes. Of, of course I'm going to complain. I'm spiky. Such a spiky flower among <laughs> us, right? I like a spiky flower, says so someone right next to oh. me. <laughs> 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 well, um, a, a woman, maybe around 30, kind of snuck up on you. She's <laughs> running a, a bright green dress with a single Pea flower, you know, <laughs> like pea, pea flower? the food. Oh, that's all right, like yeah, all right, okay, yeah. yes. So she's kind that's of taken the flower costume. theme and <laughs> taken one that's not actually a flower. Vegetable. Yes, yeah. She's basically going as a vegetable to the flower party. Well, you can so flirty, flirty with the vegetable. Well, you concentrate on your. Oh fish. yes, I'm trying to do the fishing. Very, <laughs> uh, but um, the 
is the lady looking like uh, is she looking like she's fancy and uh, does this on pur a purpose or it's a, it, it, it looks mm -hmm. like like a, it's an ironic statement i see it's I a mean, very I it's a very well cut slinky <laughs> silk nice. dress I see. Uh, is that pickpocketing or? It's pickpocketing, okay. yes. And um, um, I'll, I'll, I'll let it slip. This is a, dis a distraction, and you enroll just normally. Okay, cool. <laughs> That's good. Um, then I did that. I need three to. So uh, yes, and I have four points left. Four points left. Great. That's uh, one step of quality. Um, I think it's already two. Who cares? It's good. Um, <laughs> so you've scooped out wine and in <laughs> <it's> like, <laughs> yes, there's a small slippy jeweled, jeweled mechanical fish who's still wriggling inside nice. your... Maybe you should hide it. Yeah, I'm just like yeah, yeah. putting it in a, slipping it in a pocket or something. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sweet. And you still feel it kind of <laughs> wriggling against your thigh. Mm -mm. <laughs> Everything all right there? It's Nice. <laughs> Are you all right, my dear? Yes, I'm fine. Is it the pea flower? It's the pea flower. That sounds that what sounds original. wrong in, in English. What an original! In German, it's 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 absolutely yeah. uh -huh. What an original costume, my dear. Yes, I'd say the same to you, but no. Oh, <laughs> oh I don't know what you mean. It's, my, it's, it's always it's, it's always in fashion. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have to, I have to <laughs> roll on a self-control. <laughs> he, he, he might be somewhere, but uh, I'd say yellow is your color. Isn't it just, Isn't right? It just. <laughs> but you've brought this very manly thistle. Yes. Um, <laughs> he, um, he lends a little bit of, um, I don't know, like... Uh, uh, I once killed a man with his own fingernails. Ooh, interesting. <laughs> How did you do that? Did you make him choke on them? Uh, no, there was no choking involved. It was just a lot of work, to be honest. A lot of work. A lot of work. I had a pair of plates, just rip it off and just, you know... I don't know how to man knows how to improvise. Yes, yes. I, I lost my sword, you see, and yeah. And that's the first thing that came to mind? No rocks, sticks? No, 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 no. Okay. There, there are none of those around, no. It was, it was on a boat, you see. I'm sort of heavy, just kind of drinking <laughs> the wine. Like, <laughs> don't swallow your feet. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> well, what's, what's this? Is, is she like... You seem to be a crowd is, is she like good looking? Is she trying to be flirty? Or is she just kind of... She, she seems to be, be flirty, but not entirely kind of... Um, no, yeah, it's, a, it's a little bit I ironic the whole okay. the whole shtick she has, okay. but she's good. She's good looking, um, but she's not she's kind of. Yeah, she's rather <laughs> old, isn't she? Yeah, she's can around thirty. Oh, That's oh, rather around old. 30. I'm sorry. I, I thought it was fifty. <laughs> no, 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 thirty. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. Could I do a uh, what's it called a sense motive? Yes, you can do that. What, what's Mention that? Kindness. Mention Kindness. Oh yeah. Oh, I got eight. Ooh, that's not bad, actually. That's good. That's almost as good as mine. I'm going to roll it a bit further away from me. So, a 15 on... So, there's a 19. You yeah. should check that. But also a 1. Game. You but rolled also, a 1. Rolled but a one. you can't... Uh, if you oh. if you fail in one of the rolls, you can't, like... Yeah, you uh, failed in all. But, but you, you can have to roll two uh, ones to make it up for it or something. Uh, so you have to roll two ones, you've a definitely made it. Okay, well, you rolled one. I rolled one one. No, but I'm sorry, that's not enough. So, that's four. To get rid of that, and the 19 would be on charisma. No. <laughs> no. So he has no idea. No. Uh, do I? Uh, can I? You can also roll his motive. Yes, we are very suspicious. <laughs> and we're here like. Um, here it is. Mm, what does 15, the B3 3 stand for? It says yes, no, perhaps. Um. Oh, um, that details whether it's harder when you're wearing um, armor. Ah. Oh, right, okay. I'm All right, so, I... yeah, so yes, climbing. <laughs> yes, okay. Or riding or swimming, especially, is harder <laughs> when wearing armor. Singing, perhaps. perhaps. <laughs> Depends on the armor, I'm guessing. Yes. <laughs> well, I made my role. I'm... You, you made it. Yes. Um, 
she is, she is flirty, but that's not the um, the important thing for her. She's here for a purpose. You you can kind of sense that she's waiting for something to happen or for a mo moment to use. So mm -hmm. uh, is that she's not just here to be to be on a party and get distracted and drunk. She she's I see, something. but she's not especially interested in us or s uh, a little bit. But but you, you'd guess that's because you. would not like most of the guests at the party. All right, so just like her. So do I get the impression that she's trying to get a feel of us? Or yes, yeah. she is. Yeah. Hmm. Mm -hmm. She's probably rolling her sense motive. <laughs> right. <laughs> I see. Um, but so what brings you to this party, to this one especially? I really like flowers. Oh, that's <laughs> nice. I think everyone here does. Does yes. one need a reason to right. go to the... I mean, it's such a special occasion. The Doridana party. <laughs> Doridana, <laughs> Doridana. Doridana's party. Yes. I mean, it's the talk of the whole city, isn't it? Uh, well, the, yeah, Doridana hope it's going to be. That's true. Yes. So they've got a, they've got another member of the family in the Church of Raya. That's always the reason. Yes. Yeah, so but um, but he will be ordained today, wasn't no, he? No, he is. All, he's oh. already ordained. That was oh. last week. We're just going to celebrate now. So yeah, last but week. <laughs> but but it is his first like official official. Yes, uh, it's uh, it's the first. Occasion. Yeah, it's the first day of renewal where he's ordained and official a priest of Raya. I mean, it, it will be so exciting and, uh, I mean, with all the You flowers. think so? Wow. You don't? Well, ah, uh, I, mean, I, I think there's going to be a lot of exciting things happening tonight. Hmm. Oh, you, but, uh, I mean, you are here too, so there must be a reason that... There's a fish missing, <laughs> <laughs> says someone behind you. What? Uh, what? We are, we are the uh, totally the other lady surprised. who just dragged away the kids mm. is back oh, and right. she's looking at the fountain and just stated that As I'm, fish com missing. I'm completely ignoring her, I'm just drinking my wine. I'm looking i I'm looking over surprised. Looking quite She's uh, got a very sour look on her face. <laughs> ignoring which goes well with, with her <laughs> grey hair that's in an in an updo that looks a little bit like <laughs> she you, she could better in doors rem and doors with it and she's all she's also wearing basically the most drab dress at the party okay. you have no idea what kind of flower it's supposed to be a wallflower maybe <laughs> <laughs> but she's wearing a big ring with lots of keys on her belt oh, is she so like, like a badge of honor. housekeeper or she something might be the probably house. yes oh, okay i'm still ignoring her yeah this is outrageous. You can, so you can still hear her mumble and yes, go yes. around the fountain looking for the missing fish. So is she uh, doing anything uh, as, except from looking? Because no, she's, she's more yeah. like someone uh, accidentally pulled it out and put it somewhere. I'm just making sure that nobody can see the wriggling in my pockets. <laughs> <laughs> it's still wriggling. Just hiding it with my sleeve or yeah. something so that change. It's still wriggling. She didn't, she didn't switch it off. <laughs> you can switch them off. Well, you, you don't, don't know. know. You <laughs> probably can break them and then they don't wriggle anymore. Oh, okay. I didn't think about that. <laughs> Just yes, you just obviously didn't it. think about it. So it's yeah, really clearly. <laughs> so while while they're ignoring the caretaker right. lady, yes. I'd like to take the woman in the green dress aside. Yeah, just kind of put put an arm, a spiky arm around her. Yes, she like just uh, she uh, lets herself yeah. be let. And, I, and I just I'm kind of go. I'm sure if I like that, but okay. <laughs> you said you said things might get interesting tonight. Yes, I do hope so. Do you think there's any chance of some stabbing going on? <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> You want to use your thorns? <laughs> Possibly. I don't know. What, whatever is nearest to hand. I don't know. Maybe right, some fingernails. Now that you talk of stabbing, she looks um, next to you. There's someone who's going, who's probably going to try. What, to get stabbed or to stab someone else? Mm -hmm. People are going to be really, really, want, they're going to want to stab him, I think. Oh, I see. Who's, who, who's someone, someone just entered, three people, actually, mm -hmm. three men. And one of them is a younger man with, with kind of soft features and blonde hair that has a, a rather unfortunate cut. <laughs> <laughs> and he's wearing cornflower blue. And it's All right, probably lovely. supposed to be a cornflower. And he's followed by two guys who just wear red and are supposed to be poppies, probably. <laughs> Okay. And he's looking around uh, and with with the face then it's more like something stinks <laughs> like he's on a fish market. Yeah. <laughs> there you go with the fishing. Uh, you? A wine fountain that sold last year. Oh dear, who is he? Uh, 
I have no idea why he is here. But he's Aurelio Yabaltari. He's from a family who's also perfume merchants. They are kind of like, you know, two fighting fish in one tank. Oh, he's probably here just to mess up the party. Oh, you think he really would, like, mm, cause a disturbance or something? It would be, yeah, in that vein. Would you like me to stab him before he can do that? I'd well, love to. <laughs> Finn, you can't just offer to stab people. We're at a fancy party. I'm a mercenary. That's what I paid to do. Shh, you're not a mercenary. You're a fancy party guest. Now get in the so role. You want me to, do, to pay you to stab? I no, 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 no. don't <laughs> think that... I think he takes his role a little bit too far. He's very enthusiastic. Yes, you know? he's very much in his <laughs> character, you see. Right. Isn't it, isn't it hilarious? <laughs> you're, you're, you're right. <laughs> yes, so the smile is it's very funny. <laughs> very funny there, yes. I love the detail with the missing teeth. That's, that's yes. really cool. Yes, went to the role. Went to yes. a lot of I mean, it's just a bit of shoe polish, you know. Ah, yes. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he says why his finger seems to the. <laughs> well. Can I do a dexterity check to make sure I don't <laughs> don't accidentally? Don't, please don't. Oh, dear. Oh. oh man. She um, starts to say something, but stops when when you hear the full voice of a lady coming down from one of the stairs. There's two grand stairs in this room leading upstairs. And on one of those, a lady in a, in a beautiful wine red dress has come down a few steps, and behind her are three people dressed like divine, like priests. And two of them are definitely dressed like divine of the goddess Raria because they're hardly dressed at all. Oh. And they're so pretty, right? And they're pretty. Ooh, yes. appreciative glance. Yes, <laughs> yes. totally. Uh, it's, um, for him, it's, it's a little bit kind of a vacant pretty. <laughs> and uh, the lady okay. behind him, who's also dressed like a priestess of Raria, looks a little bit like um, she's not quite there. <laughs> so maybe. But yeah. they're beautiful. Of course. And then there's a lady who's a little bit more thick sad and she's got a friendly heart shaped face and she's wearing all the colors of the rainbow and uh, oh, rhinestones yeah. and things. And she's obviously a priestess of Tsar, of the goddess of all new things and new beginnings and children and rainbows and. <laughs> Probably unicorns. Yes. <laughs> yeah, probably <laughs> no. But uh, fairies are all kind oh, of yes. a thing. Nice. Yes. And the lady. Thank you all for coming, my dear guests, to celebrate tonight that my son Farfalio has been ordained into the church of the beautiful goddess. I invite you to dine and to drink, and I hope you have a great evening. And at the last hour of the day, when the hour of Raya begins. We will go to the rose garden and we will see the blessing of the new blooms. I hope you enjoy your stay with us. And if you're interested in getting shown around the house, then ask my, um, my lady of the keys later on um. and she will show you around. Behave and enjoy yourselves. The buffet is now open. The clap. And that's that's a general <laughs> cheering and, yeah. and clapping and people starting to gravitate towards the food that which seems to be uh, in the room to the east of you. Yeah, I keep yeah. yeah. I think we should perhaps take advantage of the tour of the house. Oh don't yes, you think I, I would love to. And I'm, I'm chatting a little bit with the pea flower lady. Yes. It's, it's like. Uh, that's, that would be so exciting to see so this house. Have you ever been here before? Oh, I've been here before, yes. Oh, and um, I mean... Last year. And I've taken the tour of the house. They have a oh. very interesting collection of paintings. Oh, really? Oh, that's nice. So, um, I mean... Uh, I like are you, are you planning <laughs> to do it again? Or do they, do they change it? Oh, I'm not sure. I don't think there's... Um, I, I would I would have heard about new paintings being added to the collection. I mean, paintings, that's yeah. one thing, but the gardens, um, I heard so oh, much about the gardens. They're supposed to be very beautiful, yes. They are very beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, although maybe a little bit stale. They've been stale. redone 20 years ago and they haven't changed much about it in the last few years. So they're still very, very pre renaissance and very strict. Maybe they should invest in a gardener. 
I guess they do have gardeners. Probably more mm. than yes, quite maybe, a few. Maybe, maybe one with a bit more vision. Perhaps. Do you think it's there's true. a possibility to look at the garden before the? Yes, of course. You can look at the. Uh, you can you can look at the uh, garden where everyone's free to go. Oh, uh, you're not allowed to go into the rose garden before the ceremony. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Oh, as you know the garden already, I'm so excited to see it. Could you just show it? Did you tour of the garden? Oh, I mean, just point us in the direction would I be. Can I, show, I can I show you a few, few nice <laughs> and secluded areas. Um, that sounds, that sounds very exciting. Very good, yes. Maybe Maybe. something the normal tour doesn't show that would be so exclusive. I mean, I have no idea if I can show you something the normal tour will not show. But uh, <laughs> come along. Oh, thank you. That would be very nice. Yes. Oh, that's yes. What do you, do you want to eat and drink now? I'm not hungry. Um, I mean, this probably. is not about being hungry. <laughs> I think it's, it's about it's about finding the most expensive things on the buffet and eating those. <laughs> Oh, I'm much more interested in seeing the house. So the curtains. <laughs> you don't want to eat the curtains, do you? On the buffet. Well, <laughs> I, I guess <laughs> that uh, the buffet will won't be like uh, empty when we. Mm, hardly, back. hardly. I think <laughs> I think the people in the kitchen are going to work in for a few more hours and just keep things coming and stuff creatures with other creatures. Yes, I mean, we don't want to impose on you, uh, I mean, as you have made oh, this hardly, nice... Oh, hardly, hardly. Um, um, this is much more interesting than anything I expected to happen tonight. Well, then, oh. yeah, let's go, let's have a look around. I would never have this served even to my dog. You hear from <laughs> Mr. Cornflower. <laughs> from the next oh, room. I can see what she meant by him making trouble. Yes. He's going to be one of those people. <laughs> she walks... Uh, out into the garden with you. And the first part of the garden is something that's very Renaissantia, so people are, ori are orienting all the styles back to the home, to the empire of Bosporan. And so there's something called a Natasio, or a Natasio, which is um, a cistern, basically, but you can swim in it and it's very nicely um, decked out in, in flowers and in lanterns, and there's lots of young people out there flirting with each other. And <laughs> Very nice. Drinking wine, yes. And there's mostly gravel strewn paths, and then behind that you can see the garden, tastefully lit by a few more lanterns, mm -hmm. but most of it is in shadow. That's where she's going with you. So is the rose garden just kind of a general, do we see, is that like a greenhouse kind of thing somewhere in the garden? Yes. So we she, she basically takes you along and says, this is the official garden where you just for meetings, secret and not so secret. Yes, I see what you for mean about affairs. it being a bit out of fashion, but yes. it still yes. has a certain flair. Mm. Yes, some of the trees are very nice and are the old roses. Mm. And there, where you can see a little bit of light in the back of the garden, that's the orangery, and behind that is the rose garden. Ah, I see. I mean, of course, in the back of my mind, I. Okay. Try to memorize yeah. the layout and but where you could. Yes. But watch out! Um, the rose garden is well protected. If you try to climb over the wall around the rose garden, they've put uh, shards of of um, wine bottles on oh, top. Oh, you're very oh. well informed. <laughs> Interesting. I don't like to know my way around. I see. I mean. Did they have trouble with people trying to climb in there? Oh yes, of course. All the big families, all of those who trade in perfume, they're always trying to steal oh. the blooms from other people. Oh, that's very unfortunate. Yes. Also, another question about the layout of the place. Is the house relatively close to the rose garden or is the rose garden, you know, like as in you could jump from on top of the house into the garden or something no, you silly could like, like that? There's more like, <laughs> more like 100 meters of garden okay. between the U-shaped house yeah. And you've been in the center part of the house where all the party um, is and you can see that the kind of the, the legs or these oh, bits of the U shape, they're not two stories but just one story and there's definitely people working in there. There seems to be a kitchen and a stable mm. and all the working bits of such a place. Mm -hmm. yeah. And at the back of the garden there is the orangery and it's kind of yeah, like... It's all, all over the whole breadth, 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 breadth of the garden, <laughs> and it's a 
low building, but with with a uh, roof that's mostly not tiled, but made out of big windows. And yes. Belhanka is one of the places where they're very good with glass, so they have actually glass windows. Mm -hmm. And the rose garden is behind, behind the And if you look closely, you can see some lights moving in the rose garden. So someone is there and someone is moving lanterns and oh. working. But you know now, that's where we have to go oh. and plant a rose. Um, good to know. Okay. Good. And that's it for now.